software as a service so you can whatever the software as a service so office 365 365 includes all that uh, Microsoft PowerPoint and um, that is what your database management systems MS Access, your MS Word, your MSL Excel uh, that is what your uh, for computing that is uh, accounts uh, software MS Excel they are the part of uh, Office uh, 365, Dynamic 365, Azure Active Directory some of the services provide Microsoft Azure under software as a service SaaS, PaaS, YAS. Okay, we will study and then when you will get the uh, idea over them. If you practically create an account here under your azure.microsoft.com, then you can uh, have somewhat idea actually what what are we are doing. Okay, so first of all, you need to have somewhat um, idea what I am doing, what is cloud computing. As I told you that you need not to establish infrastructure, a computer servers, okay. But you need have an interface, no? That is at your end. Uh, how can you interact with those services, uh, those servers? At your at your end, you have a computer, no? If you are an individual, you want to avail free services. Otherwise, uh, you are running a business. So within your business organization, you want to run Amazon, that is what your Microsoft Azure services, you have the uh, computers, okay? And don't, without any computers and how can you do that? But you, you need not any um, large scale infrastructure servers and uh, that is what networking devices, okay? And uh, that is what firewalls, so many like that. But client from, as a client, you need to get, okay? So let us see. First of all, uh, we will compare all this, how Azure pay as you go pricing. First of all, what were we do, uh, compare pricing to AWS. So Azure pricing to AWS. First, let us see what is this. Here, Azure virtual machines. So virtu virtual machines, as I told you that, virtual machine can run on Windows. 750 hours each of B1s and B2. Okay, we need to, whenever we study all this, then we will try simply understand. Now, I don't want to go into this. Okay, Azure virtual machines, they will, virtual machine will be capable to run on different operating systems. Okay, here, this virtual machine run over Windows. This 12 months, okay. This virtual machine run over Linux. How many operating systems we have studied? They are providing only two operating systems, Linux and Windows. Okay, the virtual machines always uh, always this is for only 12 men this is always azure sql database structured query language database okay they will provide the database sql structured query language database serv uh, serverless usage for month 32 gb storage somewhat uh, services okay azure blob storage Okay, this is cloud computing storage as I have discussed it here. This is what Microsoft Azure Blob, uh, Blob Storage. Azure Blob Storage is Microsoft object storage solution that always allows storing large amounts of un unstructured. If Suppose if you have unstructured data at your end, that is very large amount of data, you can store that sto data in Microsoft Azure Blob Storage. Okay, next, where I am here? Okay. I want to okay now here uh, this is always this is for 12 months okay these uh, these are all what let us see uh, uh, pay as you going price works huh? these are paying services huh? comparing pricing okay next always Azure event grade 1 lakh operations per month so under this Azure event grade you can do 1 lakh operations per month okay so Azure functions 1, mini, one, one million request means uh, 10 lakh requests under the Azure functions Azure app service 10 web mobile or API apps with 1 GB 1 gigabyte storage 1 hour per day Azure Cosmos database thousand request units per second provision through these are the services sir. until unless na? so let us uh, explore 
free services first if you don't you are individual you are a student you want to do some word practice over microsoft azure and you don't want to pay so whether create an azure account with no upfront commitment so means we first of all we need to create an account take advantage of free products see all free services here if we click here we will get we will get all free services these products are free up to the specified monthly amounts so means these products whatever we see here they are free free up to the specified monthly amount means if it is you are using beyond of that okay you need to pay some are always free to all azure customers some services are always free okay for azure customers all azure customers whenever you create an account and once you become the customer of azure microsoft azure some services always free okay some are free for 12 months some are free for 12 months to new customers only okay see all services what are the free take advantage of free products these are the advantages of these products are free up to the specified monthly amounts after that you need to pay some are always free to all azure customers and some are free for 12 months let us check back that what are azure free sorry, azure advisor okay this is what free monthly amount unlimited eh? always free period so which is always given so that is free for all customers which is given as 12 months it is free up to 12 months only suppose archive storage if you want to store and manage rarely accessed data with locally redundant storage lrs or geo redundant storage here storage so 10 gigabyte lrs storage and 10 gigabyte lrs or grs write and retrieval 100 reads so this is not for always this service you want to archive your files and data so 12 months after the 12 months you need to pay so some uh, some are always free to azure customers these products are free up to the specified monthly accounts okay here monthly account specify 12 months after that you need to pay so this is always free app service quickly create powerful apps if you if you want as i told you that here uh, what is where here i uh, what are the services here i told you that so as i told you that here what what do you mean of this try to understand here in app service app service means quick we can quickly create powerful apps okay for any platform or device any device using your choice of tools including node.js and php so node node.js javascript uh, framework this is what by using a php pre hypertest processor a language i think it is for server side okay so by using of this uh, node.js that is what javascript by using of php we can create powerful apps okay for any platform this is always okay we can create 10 web applications mobile application 10 mobile applications or application programming interface apps with 1 gigabyte storage one hour per day so you can create apps so whenever i was uh, briefing here um, the so this network microsoft azure it helps developers and professionals means so computer software engineers who want to develop their applications so you can develop build up your application and post that application and that application can be managed so same this is the service they are providing as per that app service okay you can be able to create 10 web application 10 mobile applications with 1 gigabyte storage okay 1 hour per day okay this is you need to study app configuration store and manage configurations for all your azure apps suppose once you have created any app that can be stored and managed okay this is always 1000 requests per day with 10 megabyte storage so whenever you want to uh, manage that config what that is your app so 1000 requests per day so per day you can send 1000 requests to configure 
your you if you want to change anything in your app okay 